Motor Week is made possible by TireRack.com, RockAuto.com, and State Farm. Quality always matters when you're trying to decide which new car to buy. And the results of a new survey show which brands are moving up the ranks. The 2017 J.D. Power Vehicle Dependability Study has just been released. And for the sixth year in a row, Lexus has held on to the top spot. But this year, there's a twist. Porsche also ties with Lexus as the two most dependable brands. Toyota moved up to third as the highest ranking non-premium brand. Hyundai jumped from 19th to 6th, joining mass marketers Buick, Chevrolet, and Honda in the top 10. Mercedes-Benz, BMW, and Jaguar also ranked in the top tier. Researchers say technology-related problems continue to plague new cars. 22% of all the problems reported centered on infotainment systems in cars. That's slightly higher than last year. The survey covers three years of ownership on over 35,000 2014 model year vehicles. Mercedes-Benz is rethinking the possibility of entering the U.S. pickup truck market. There's been some talk that Mercedes, after first saying its new X-Class midsize truck was too small for America, now wants to tap into our seemingly insatiable appetite for personal pickups. And it might even be made here in the U.S. When the X-Class launches late this year, it will only be offered in Europe, South Africa, Australia, and Latin America. With luxury-laden domestic pickups already fetching $70,000 and more, there certainly seems to be a market here for the X-Class. And Dodge is showing yet more proof that high-output V8s are not dead yet. The street-legal but drag-strip-ready Hemi-powered 2018 Dodge Challenger SRT Demon will be unveiled at the upcoming New York International Auto Show. Dodge has been releasing video teasers on social media for more than a month. Still, we'll have to wait until April to get all the high-horsepower details. And that's the latest automotive update for this week's Motor News.